Okay, our groceries are now unpacked. You know if you've seen any of my grocery hauls before that we start with actually showing you how much everything cost. So for this week, we've spent $512.44. You would also know, if you've seen my grocery hauls before, then I get my husband's cigarettes in there also, which is about $200 for cigarettes and the filters and papers. Alrighty, let's start back here with our drinks. So we have Solo, 24 cans, and Sunkissed, also 24 cans. Nothing but orange juice that has the pulp in it, that's three litres. The pommies, we have those instead of chips if we're wanting to have steak, chips and salad or something like that. I've gone down to one litre of milk because we um, are throwing so much milk away, we don't drink a lot of it. So I thought instead of two litres, we'll just grab the one litre. Maxi Bon ice creams, my husband enjoys those at night time after dinner. So he went looking for them the other day and I said, you told me not to buy you anymore. So I figured I should get him some. He maybe just sort of said that one day. Some baking pieces. You, it's a two pack here. So you've um, just got two pack. Individual packs. So you're not sort of opening everything. Whoops. Sorry about that, Mike. Oh, I flipped up. We also got some cheese. So we've got our plowmans, some pickled onion and also some smoked. That pickled onion one, guys, was really, really nice when I got it um, a couple of weeks back, so I decided to grab some more. <laughs> the feta, that's um, marinated in herb and oils. That is delicious. I like that um, throughout my salads. A garlic paste. I like to have that on hand instead of having to get the garlic out. And the bits and pieces <laughs> of... The actual white bit that gets everywhere. I don't like that. So, yeah, I like to have that instead. The mild salami and the turkey breast. They are still on sale, guys, for two for $5. It's nice to have a variety, I think. Some cream cheese. Not cream cheese, sorry. Sour cream. Thickened cream. And a Philly um, sweet chilli. Philly <laughs> um, is great with crackers and things like that, as you probably know. This hummus here is one that I haven't had before, but it's um, it's a little three pack. Now, my husband doesn't eat it, so I thought I'd get that one to try. That way, I only need to open one little container. This Latina fresh um, sun dried tomato, you can see it there. Creamy sun dried tomato goes on the actual egg fettuccine there. We'll have that either by itself or as an accompaniment. Got some shortcut bacon, some salmon. I love salmon. <laughs> some salted cashews, pineapple clumps. I enjoy those. I don't like them, but I do <laughs> like the raspberry bullets. And so does my husband. So I've got four, uh, three packets of that. Um, you would have seen the cigarettes. So two packets of cigarettes, four packets of filters, and four packets of papers. These biscuits. Now, they're really, really nice. They're very much like a um, biscotti, but a little bit thinner. But they have that same sort of texture. And they're really, really thin, as you can see there. But delicious. A little expensive, but well worth it if you enjoy it. Got some twiggy sticks, so just the mild ones there. We also got some green grapes, some bananas, raspberries, blueberries, and strawberries. We got one, two, three, four, five yellow nectar, yellow fleshed nectarines. We got some apricots. This one here got a bit squished along the way. <laughs> Never mind. Um, four um, tomatoes, a mango, some cos hearts for our lettuce, two avocados, three red capsicum, two bunches of shallots. 
or green onions, red onions or Spanish onions, whichever you call them. <laughs> our dog food on the back here. When I was actually getting our dog food out, the dogs were getting very excited as I've run out of their clunkers, which are the little meatball type things that they um, really, really like. See them there, the little meatballs? And um, so they were getting very excited and I was like, no, you've got to wait until I finish doing the video. So they're waiting patiently. I think Mr. Coda's down there. She's fallen asleep in her bed waiting. <laughs> and their milk, they got four um, little litres of milk as well. We got, have you tried this toilet paper? It is flushable and it's like a wet wipe. So much nicer than using normal scratchy bum, as I call it, toilet paper. So if you haven't tried it, maybe give it a try and let me know what you think. We got some white potatoes, they're washed, so I don't have to do that. And I'll obviously wash them, but I won't have to wash all the dirt off them. Some bagels, that's the um, five pack of bag bagels. Helga's bread, it's wholemeal loaf. Plowman's rolls, they're really nice. I always get four things of pet mix for the cats, um, but they must have run out because they've given me one, so I have to hunt some of that down. Did I go through the onions? I think I have. So that is pretty much all any eggs. I don't know that I told you about our eggs. We've got 18 eggs. So guys, that is our grocery haul for this week. It is a Christmas time in the middle of the week, coming up in about three or four days' time. So we are actually not hosting Christmas this year. It is going to be my youngest daughter. She's um, built her house and has now moved in, or has been moved in now for about six months, five or six months. So this is her first year hosting Christmas. So we're all looking forward to that. So that'll be nice. So um, what do you think my favorite item is out of everything on here? Now, I can tell you what it is. You might think it's the bullets. You might think it's the strawberries. But no. My favourite item, guys, is the cold smoked salmon. Love, love, love salmon. I could eat it all day, every day. For breakfast, lunch and dinner <laughs> and have nothing else. I absolutely love salmon. So my favourite item for this week's video, or for this video, is salmon. So guys, don't forget to tick off all those little boxes if you're entering my giveaway. My giveaway is open to everybody. Um, it's not just somebody in Australia. If you live in the United States, or in London, or anywhere else, I will post a hamper to you. Now the hamper is going to be full of different bits and bobs. Um, it's not just Christmas related or anything like that. So what you need to do is watch my videos where I have put, the, um, you know, video number one, number two, I think we're up to number seven. Um, and what my favorite item is. You need to comment on my video. Don't put what my favorite item is in the comments because you're actually giving it away to everybody else. Unless you're really, really sweet and you really want to do that. So, comment on my video. You need to be a subscriber. You need to be 18 years of age or older. You then need to go to my email and let me know in my email what my favorite item for that particular video is. So if you tick all of those little boxes, you will be in the draw. And whoever's managed to get all of my clues for the videos and sent it through to me on my email, the email will be listed down below. You will then be drawn out by random, by the computer generator, and you will win my hamper. Now this competition, guys, ends on the 24th of December, only a couple of days away. You don't have to watch um, or you don't have to comment each time. You can leave it right to the end and then, you know, get the clue out of all of my videos and send it through to me. So you've still got a few days to find out what those clues are. 
And um, yeah, you'll be well on your way to being in the entry to win my hamper. It will be worth it. <laughs> um, so jump on board and have a bit of fun and um, find my clues. Let me know what they are. And on the 24th at 6pm Australian Eastern Standard Time, we will find out who our winner is. Anyhow, guys, that's enough for me for this video. I shall talk to you very soon because I've got to get a few more videos up to um, get myself back to where I need to be. Have a wonderful day. I shall talk to you shortly.